you know, I don't even think I can fit this on camera, but guys, we're opening 10 Hidden Fates tins, and these are the 2020 reprints. Oh, I'm not sure if you can see it, but in the corner, you can probably tell, has like a little cardboard semicircle because it has the cardboard inserts in the 2020 reprints. If you haven't seen our 2020 uh, reprint series, make sure to check it out because we've done an opening showing you what the 2020 reprint is. I'm going to open one here and then we're going to take all the packs out of the other ones. I want to show you how the 2020 reprint is and how you can tell the difference. But obviously, like I mentioned before, you can see the semicircle here. You have a better understanding once I show you right there. So you can see through the window, the, the little corner, that's how you're going to differentiate between the new print and the old print. But let's get the Gary Dust out of here. So boom, I'm going to make a pile of each single set so all the Charizards, all the uh, Raichus and all the Gyarados is together but obviously the four packs together will be one tin so we'll make sure we'll work out how many hits we're getting per tin but let's get into opening all these tins up. Yo, I just realised this is 40 packs of Hidden Fates. In total we opened 120 packs of Hidden Fates today. I uh, did separate videos, smaller videos, bigger videos and this is the biggest one with 10 packs in it. Uh, so I have two Hidden Fates tins, four Gyarados tins and four Raichu tins. What I did with the other two, because obviously I hope this would have came out of two crates, but I used one uh, Charizard tin for the 2019 vs 2020 opening and I kept one sealed. But I opened one of my 2019, so I swapped the 2020 with my 2019 to do that video. But you probably here for some code cards. Here's some promo code cards if you're here for that. Um, so yeah, I'll go through them quickly. You can pause it. Did you see that one? I think there's one more there. Uh, there we go. So we're gonna let's get into it. Let's, we're gonna start with the Charizard because obviously two there, but 40 packs in one opening. I didn't realize that um, who was gonna do that many. I didn't even realize we're doing 120 packs today. But obviously we opened a total of 30 packs, 30 tins of Hidden Fates. So oh, and if you're new here, in any opening over 30 packs, I want to do straight to the rare. So what we're gonna do is we go to the rare like that, and we're done. Boom. So just so we don't waste 30 minutes opening 40 packs, because that's how it would typically typically long it will take that. It'll typically take that long 30 minutes for um what you call it 40 packs if you was to do four from the back. So here we got one hit. Uh, um, obviously we opened like 30 videos of hidden fates. We got another 20 on the hard drive for the 2019 10s, and then we got like five, six today. Uh, so here's the code card. I hope I've showed you all the code cards. But nothing in there as well so this way i don't think i showed you the last code card so we'll go show you that so if you like this sort of opening for the bigger openings we do lots of bigger openings i have a few hundred pack openings i did last week we literally started doing this last week so any videos recorded after the last week that oh what a double pack so in the charizard tin we'll put the code card away so let's put start with the Charmander. I need a few Charmanders. These Charmanders are £100 in PSA 10. This is looking fresh. So we're going to get this one graded. Let's see the back. Might get a 10. Let's get this graded. So boom, we have some grade, graded fits. I keep telling them they got to get me sponsor me because that's what all I'm using for my PSA. But obviously I submit with graded gem as well. So I got to support their product. But I pretty much plug it every time we get a massive hit in the videos. Uh, and some well we're not big enough to get sponsored but boom we got that Char uh, Charmander why did I put it away we got to put it in the back and I'll put it away at the end of the video but this Charizard what do you guys think of the centering would this pass as a 10 could potentially do but I'll put it in the binder collection for now because I have about 20 of these 10 20 between that number we pulled most of mine today I put we pulled like four or five today again I put it to the side um, but yeah so obviously we've got to take some times with the hits because these are some, these are the crazy hits here guys. It's not like Sword and Shield, it's not like Rebel Clash, but boom, we got a reverse energy, put that to the side, um, and then we got this Zapdos Hollow. So boom, and then there's a code card there for you lot. Uh, so yeah, let's sleeve this up. So the Zapdos was the first hit in the second tin, but we did get uh, Charmander, Charizard, and the Hollow uh, com uh, Misty Command in first tin. So. So three hits in that one, but let's see what we can do in tin number two. We got right to GX um, and then the code card and boom. I'd be so rich if I sold all the code cards that we get, but I give it to you guys. So show your support by subscribing if you're new here. Um, but yeah, two hits so far in the second tin. Let's see where we can get any full art shinies, but nope, nothing in this one. I'm going to put the camera a little bit up. Alright, last one now. 
we got type no shiny and that's it so there's a code card type no shiny here so three hits again in tin number two of charizard let me know if you like type no it's not a character i like but i think this is an era of pokemon i didn't really collect like i think sun and moon is it a new pokemon uh but yeah boom let's see we're on the gyarados now tin number one of gyarados but just a reverse energy so put that aside there's the code card boom let me know if you like this way obviously this would be a 40 40 minute opening um charmeleon again we just pulled one of these in the last video i don't know i was saying uh before i never pulled a charmeleon uh shiny before so we got charmeleon shiny here so boom uh let me flag this up and let's put this in here so i didn't even check the condition but this looks like psa 10 from a mile away um like the centering's good and the back is flawless so uh, look at this all we need is a charizard to complete that but for you packs here you never know we could get some but just a reverse brox grit and then we got a porion holo res so let's get that one out of there and yeah this one's going for a bit let me know if this goes for a bit i think this has gone up a bit because it was like one pound for years and then now it's like 150 but obviously that's not really no difference but better than nothing a couple of things we've got a shiny frogadier so just a shiny frogadier in this one i like doing it straight to the hits because obviously we've seen the comments i don't know what happened to this leaf uh, going bin. Uh, we see the comments on comments over and over again obviously we must have opened over a thousand packs of hidden fakes on this channel by now um, today was 120 alone we've done 100 packs opening when we started the channel uh, etc but oh the circuitry but yeah like there's only 68 comments on comments and non hollow rares in this set um, or just under that like 60 so we've seen everything um, plenty of time so we don't need to really see them again I don't think you guys want to see them again but it's actually hollow there just as oh a double hit so we got boswell uh shiny full art and then we got zapdos hollow rare so let's leave up the Z um sleeve these up so a full art first is this the first full art yeah this is the first full art we got and then we got zapdos hollow rare so let's clean up the station and let's get into the next one so make sure you redeem those codes because they're in the bin now and they're gone forever but just a hollow energy and nothing there so we'll put the energies to the side because we put them in our reverse listing i'll get those ones up asap because they're easier to list but oh oh a double hit so this code card uh let's put the charizard down we got the set ui full art shiny another one so the gary is doing well and then we got charizard this one is more likely to get psa 10 so let's leave this one up and get this one for grading sorry i'm putting them into um card savers now i just don't want to get them to get damaged these are all for my personal collection well they're not going to get damaged they're all in sleeves i never had any damage issues from putting them in the back but just to make sure and then it's easier for me to put them away into my personal collection um and then so then separating it later so super gas you know what happened i ordered six tins from i know i ordered 10 tins from my distributor and she sent me the order she said 800 pounds and it ended up being 10 crates not 10 tins so uh, 10 case uh, one case has 60 one case has six in it sorry and then yeah we had 10 of those but pikachu reverse nothing again um so yeah how many tins i think we went through so many tins so many times uh but we're in tin number two now uh two third pack in tin number two let's see oh we got route shiny i want to keep a god of War shiny uh i think i don't know why i just like god of always like god of all um i think is it emerald days I think it might have been from emerald um but yeah we got misty's water command here another hollow rare not worth too much i'm covering up all the full arts now um but it's the last pack of tin number two and just a hollow energy so let me know if you love this look already eight minutes in it would have been much much longer with this many packs we'll open it uh, but luckily we're doing it this way but yes we got the Moltres, Zapdos and Aikuno GX here so boom another nice card uh, do I need this one for my collection I need to check how many of these I kept because I want to keep at least three of these this is a very very good one so that's first hit of tin number three of Gyarados Perfect. Uh, ooh Gyarados now in the Gyarados tin so there's a regular Gyarados there is no Gyarados shiny imagine if we had a red full art shiny Gyarados I don't know how they forgot that should have done a shiny right shoot well they did a charizard but from the promos 10 promos anyways 
uh, Shiny New would have been awesome, but we get that in Shiny Legends. But we got Oran Grove. I still have this from earlier this year when I picked up some from the third or third print or whatever. I don't even know. You can't tell how many print runs it is. You just tell by the restock date what print run it is. I think I got it from the third print because I picked it up in June. Uh, those tins, but yeah, still on my eBay. And ooh, there's something here. Another Gary does. So oh, we're already finishing. You know what? Uh, I'm gonna try. I have to sell the other ones. So there's no rush. I got 30 to sell. Once I sell a few of them, I might end up opening the rest or something. We'll see how well they do sell. But guys, um, on to the right shoe tin number one. I'll keep track of how many tins we're opening. So there's three right shoe tins and just reverse and boom, Wiggly Tough GX here. So boom, Wiggly Tough GX. So two full arts only in 10 tins, not the greatest. However, we did pull a Shine Charizard earlier. I'm not sure if I told you that. But routes again, just the routes shiny. So let me get this code card out of the way for you. And routes shiny hollow. So let's see how many uh, shiny cards we can get in this one. How many shiny full arts? Because we didn't get many. But yeah, shiny cards are in the reverse slots on plastic there. Um, but yeah, no shinies in this box. Oh, just a reverse energy but we got the Vaporeon holo rare which is a good one uh, probably the best is this the best holo rare obviously my favorite is Jesse and James but uh, Eevee one is also dope oh just a coughing reverse let me know if you like me going straight to the reverse straight to the rare rather than going through all the commons and uncommons again a reverse zap does not bad but then we got Misty's war command Put that to the side while I put that there. So boom. How many tins was that? So we got one tin, two tins. I think we only opened two packs, so yeah, I should have separated them earlier. Uh, but this is the last one. We got some space to separate them, but we got Magnazone. I think I grabbed them from the bottom, so it's not gonna be accurately a tin now. Uh, so sorry about that, but yeah, I'll let you know when we've done groups of four anyways. Uh, but Magnezone pulled loads of these this video, so at least we've done that. I think I see some full art -y something. Ooh, Naganadel GX shiny full art. So we got Naganadel, we got double hit, let me not forget that. But we got Naganadel full art, another full art. Beautiful there. And then we got this Wiggly Tough GX. I wish, I wish I kept at least one of every GX so I don't have to go back for it. But obviously, the only way we was able to afford so many is because we sell the stuff we don't need. Like I'll sell that and I can buy maybe one more tin, etc, etc. I'll put the money towards the one more tin. But yeah, we've done four packs. Now we're going into uh, some more. Uh, the next tin, we're going number tin number two off right you. Uh, but Noibat shiny cards, so that's nice. And then boom. Lots of lots of shiny hollows. My eBay is going to be crazy today. Uh, these all will be uploaded. If you're watching this, uh, they all should be uploaded. This will be the very last hidden face video of the week. Uh, but I think we've got something here. Oh my days! I paid twenty pound for this dark ride during lockdown, and I finally pulled it. I don't think I've ever pulled this one. I pulled it late last year or early last year when they released, and it wasn't one for my collection. So this one will be going into the grading. So. Um, let's get that and all the espions and everything has gone up crazy amounts but this star cry is about 20 quid which is quite a lot i don't know sorry i took it he just stick that tab on but i don't know i feel there's something about the purple dark ride that makes it look so cool uh, i think my cousin was a dark ride guy i can't remember he had plat which one was it platinum and was it platinum it was in i can't remember but let me not forget we got a double here we got the starmy gx there as well I didn't even check the back of the dark rice, so we'll do it after this one. Uh, Snorlax and then code card. Oh, guys, dark hidden face is awesome. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. It was just the top loader, just dust on the top loader, so we're good. Did you see that white spot? Did you think we had a white spot there? Things on the sleeve or dust uh, top loader, we're good. Oh, I shook. I was about to take that out the graded fit. Okay, it's not opening that side. I think we got something here. Ooh, reverse Jesse and James. Doesn't look as good in reverse form, to be honest. But we got pins here. GX. So that's 10 number two. So not bad. And now we're on the final tin. 
of Hidden Fates that we're gonna open for this week. And the next ones, I'll save some tins for later in the month. Obviously, I wanna get these all up ASAP. So, ooh, Celestia shiny cards. So we've got Celestia the shiny, hollow rare. So, it's the sleeves. Let's see if we get some more pull ups. We've got the Charizard from these. Oh, just a uh, Giovanni Exile full art. I thought we got another shiny full art there for a second. We haven't pulled any shiny uh, Hidden Fates, uh, shiny Vault trainers today, however, but I hardly pull any of them. I think I pulled one of each before, but uh, yeah, just gonna be a reverse fire energy. So put that aside, and then you get the code card. Final pack. We'll do four from the back for the final pack. I'll turn it around immediately. Uh, four from the back then, so one, two, three, four. I know it's upside down, don't worry. Um, so boom, just keep the suspense for final pack. We got Chansey, Grav, Lajuani's Exile, Charmander, Magic Up. Oh, the card's about to fall off the table. Fairy, uh, Coughing, our uh, Scyther, and then we end it off with Jesse and James, Hollow, Rare. So boom, very, very good opening. We got tons of hits. Let me focus it on the back wall. You guys can see how many hits we got. Look at this. Boom, and obviously these are stacked. These are literally stacked of hits. Um, so let's go into the recap. So boom, these are the hits out of 10 2020 Hidden Fates uh, reprinted tins. So we got our promo cards that Charizard did a backflip. <laughs> I should do a replay, but probably you won't have time to do that. Uh, but yeah, two Charizards, we got three Gyarados promos. Four Gyarados, sorry. And then four Raichus, right? Yeah, here we go. And then we have a Hollow Red Zapdos, Vaporeon, Misty, and then Jesse and James, and then our hits, the regular GXs. We have Gyarados, two of those, Charm, uh, Charizard, uh, we got two, but one is in the back. Raichu, Moltres, Zapdos, Articuno, Pinsir, Starmie, Wigglytuff, two of those. We literally got every single regular GX apart from the Mewtwo, which is decent. We did pull Mewtwo's in other openings uh, today, so we pretty much got all the regular GX's today. But Giovanni's XL, full art, only regular full art we got today. And then, Shiny cards, Type Null, Exocetry, Froakie, 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 uh, Routes, two of those, Oranguru, uh, Magnazon, Noibat, Celesteela, and we go into the big boy full art hits. We got Dissectuai, Boswell, and Naganadel. But don't forget the three I'm keeping in my collection. Obviously, I'm going to keep the Charizards. All the Charizards I keep from my personal collection. But look, we have a little evolution line here. However, we don't have the shiny Charizard, which we did pull in another video. But we got this shiny Dark Ride, which is epic to get because. Um, I paid £20 for this raw. You would have seen the accurate market value earlier anyways. I paid £20 for the single on eBay. Dark right and shiny Eevee I bought raw during lockdown. Um, because the prices were going up and up and up for all the Hidden Fates cards. I thought, let me grab them now uh, before they go any up. Because I might regret not having them in my collection. These I already have in my collection. Bought loads, pulled loads of Charmanders. Don't think I ever pulled the Charmeleon, but we pulled two today. But let me... Since it's the end, we'll just show you. Um, look, these are some of the hits we got today. I'm not gonna tease all of them, but you can probably see uh, a lot of them there. Um, but look, look at that. That's how you end off a 2020 Hidden Fates reprint opening. So 30 tins we opened today. That, if I'm right, we opened 120 packs of Hidden Fates today. We didn't get the craziest amount of hits, but we got so many good hits. Uh, we got this Charizard, obviously you can see we got the Mewtwo, make sure to check out the other videos, Charmeleon again, loads of Charizards, uh, some of these are from other openings of course, um, Lucario, love Lucario, look at this, we got two different Lucarios, I'm not sure if I'm going to grade these or sell them on eBay Raw, because I already have these in my collection, so that's something I'm debating, but obviously we have lots of cool stuff from different openings that we opened today, uh, but guys, if you like this video, make sure to like, make sure to subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one, peace.